This screencast demonstrates how to model a filter in Aspen Plus software. Open the saved file from Chapter 4.2, Crystallizers. Go to the Solid Separator tab and place the filter block on the flow sheet. Connect the outlet of the crystallizer to the filter block. Create and connect the liquid solid streams coming out. Double click the block. Aspen supports several calculation modes for solid liquid separators, drum filters, belt filters, and disc filters. The last three require input about the cake geometry and saturation, and the specific filtration model. Thus, we will limit our filter model to a simple solid liquid separator. The two specifications to consider are fraction of solids to solid outlet and fraction of liquid to liquid outlet. Enter 0.98 and 0.999 respectively. Specify the outlet flash conditions as one bar and a temperature change of 0 degrees Celsius. Run the simulation. A warning will pop up, as we did not explicitly set the particle size distribution in the CIPSD substream of the outlet. This is normal, as we relied on Aspen to implicitly determine this for us. View the stream results. You will notice that nearly all the solid copper sulfate pentahydrate has been separated out into S2. Keep in mind that this filter specification is not realistic, and in practice, the filter cake would have a higher moisture content, typically ranging anywhere from 5% to 20%. We use idealized values for demonstration purposes only. Watch the following video on the YouTube playlist to learn how to model a cyclone separator at Aspen Plus. For more Aspen Plus tutorials, visit the Cornell CBE YouTube channel.